When someone's very beautiful, you might see people taking a second look at them as they walk down the street. Or when a scene in nature is very striking, we stop to admire it. Beauty attracts us as much as power does. But when we think about beauty, something that's physically beautiful lasts only a few moments of our attention. And then we want to look at something else. But when we hear a beautiful poem, we don't mind reading it again and again. When we see a movie with a lovely message, we don't mind re-watching that movie. When we know something has a little bit more depth, that beauty stays a lot longer. Even with us, the facial features of the person start to matter after a while. What really matters is the way they talk to us or how attentive they are. When person is applying for a job, we use qualities of virtues to sell ourselves. We like to say we work well in a team, we have confidence, we have leadership skills, we have discipline. Or even when a person is getting involved in a relationship, the way they'll describe the person to someone else is they're so trustworthy, they're responsible, they're fun, they're kind, they're loving. We admire these things in other people and we want to be admired for these qualities in ourselves. The second three days of Navratri is adoring and worshipping Lakshmi, who is the wealth of virtues, the wealth of our inner qualities, that which makes us truly look beautiful or add beauty in our lives and in the lives of other people. Lakshmi is definitely physical wealth, but she's so much more. And therefore we invoke Lakshmi so that we may grow in beauty inside out.